Don't believe this common myth. Many of us go through life thinking we understand ourselves and the world around us, but what if I told you that some of the most profound truths about human psychology are hiding in plain sight, waiting to be discovered? In this video, we'll uncover the 13 secret psychological facts about people that can transform your life. From the surprising ways you perceive yourself to the hidden power of a simple smile, we'll explore the depths of human behavior and thought. Whether you're curious about how your clothes influence your mood or why certain thoughts dominate your mind, this journey through the intricacies of psychology will leave you both enlightened and empowered. So, buckle up and get ready to dive into the fascinating world of human psychology and uncover the secrets that can help you live a more fulfilling and balanced life. Fact number one. Your perception of yourself. Have you ever looked in the mirror and wished you looked different? We've all experienced that moment of self-doubt. But did you know that psychological studies have shown people see you as 20% more attractive than you see yourself? It's true. We are often our harshest critics, focusing on our perceived flaws rather than our strengths. This critical self-perception can drive us to improve, but it's essential to balance it with self-acceptance. Imagine walking into a room with the knowledge that people find you more attractive than you think. This isn't just about vanity. It's about projecting self-assurance and positive energy. Think of someone you know who radiates confidence. They might not fit conventional beauty standards, but their presence is magnetic. This is the essence of true attractiveness, confidence, positivity and self-acceptance. Embrace these qualities and you'll notice a significant difference in how others perceive you and how you see yourself. When we understand that our perception of ourselves is more critical than others' perception of us, it opens a new realm of possibilities. The key to improving your self-perception is to focus on your unique qualities and strengths. Practice self-acceptance instead of obsessing over your flaws. Marcus Aurelius once said, accept yourself as you are. By doing so, you can cultivate internal confidence. True confidence comes from within. When you work on your skills and knowledge, your security naturally increases. Another practical tip is to take care of your posture. Keep your head up and shoulders back. Good posture not only makes you look more confident, but also makes you feel more confident. Practice gratitude by being thankful for what you have instead of lamenting what you lack. This stoic attitude can completely transform your perspective. Carl Rogers, a renowned psychologist, said, The curious paradox is that when I accept myself just as I am, then I can change. So, remember, true attractiveness goes far beyond what we see in the mirror. It's a combination of self-confidence, a positive attitude, and personal acceptance. Next time you look in the mirror, Remember, you're 20% more attractive than you think. Fact number two, the hidden power of a smile. Picture this. You're walking down the street, lost in thought when someone smiles at you. Instinctively, you smile back. It's a simple gesture, but it can change your entire day. When we smile, our brains release a cocktail of feel-good chemicals like dopamine endorphins and serotonin. These natural mood lifters make us feel happier and more relaxed. But it doesn't end there. Smiling is contagious. When you smile at someone, they're likely to smile back, creating a ripple effect of positivity. Let's delve into why a smile holds so much power. A smile communicates warmth, approachability and friendliness. It's a universal sign of goodwill that transcends languages and cultures. Dr. Paul Ekman, a pioneer in the study of facial expressions, discovered that facial expressions can influence our emotions. When we smile, even if we don't feel particularly happy, our brain interprets the physical action as a sign that we are happy, releasing those feel-good chemicals. 
This is known as the facial feedback hypothesis. You can harness this power in your daily life by making a conscious effort to smile more often. It might feel strange at first, especially if you're not in the best mood. But try it as an experiment. For the next five minutes, smile continuously. Notice how your mood shifts. This simple practice can transform your interactions and your day. Think about a time when someone's smile lifted your spirits. It's a small act with a big impact. In stressful situations, a smile can be a powerful tool. Before a job interview, smile to yourself in the mirror. It not only relaxes you, but also projects confidence and positivity. Moreover, smiling has long-term benefits. Regular smiling can reduce stress, lower blood pressure, and even enhance your immune system. It's like a natural medicine with no side effects. So the next time you find yourself in a challenging situation or just want to improve your day, remember the hidden power of a smile. It's your personal superpower, ready to be used anytime, anywhere. Fact number three, emotional anchoring. Have you ever smelled something that instantly took you back to your childhood? Maybe the aroma of freshly baked cookies transports you to your grandmother's kitchen. This phenomenon is known as emotional anchoring, where an external stimulus like a smell or a song evokes vivid memories and emotions. Our minds are incredibly powerful, and they use these anchors to create deep connections between our experiences and emotions. Think about the last time you heard a song that brought back memories of a specific time in your life. Maybe it was a summer when you felt carefree and happy, or perhaps it reminded you of a person you haven't seen in years. This connection between an external stimulus and a memory is what psychologists call emotional anchoring. It happens because our senses are directly linked to the parts of our brain responsible for memory and emotion. Emotional anchoring can influence our decisions and how we view the past. We often idealize happy moments and forget the reasons why a relationship ended or why a particular phase in our life changed. This idealization can lead us to want to reconnect with people or places from our past, even if those relationships or times were not as perfect as we remember. Understanding this psychological mechanism is crucial for our emotional well-being. It helps us distinguish between idealized memories and reality, allowing us to make more conscious decisions about our current and future relationships. Nostalgia can be a powerful emotion, but it's essential to remember that our memories are often colored by our emotions at the time. By recognizing this, we can appreciate our past without letting it dictate our present. To use emotional anchoring to our advantage, we can create positive anchors for ourselves. Surround yourself with things that bring you joy and comfort. Play music that makes you happy. Fill your space with scents that relax you and engage in activities that uplift your spirit. By doing this, you can create a positive environment that supports your emotional well-being and helps you stay grounded in the present. Fact number four, influence of clothing on mood and perception. Imagine waking up in the morning, opening your closet and seeing a sea of colors and styles. Did you know that the choice you make at that moment can determine not only how you look, but also how you feel throughout the day? It's as if your clothes were a kind of magic potion for your mood. Studies have shown that the colors and styles we choose can have a direct impact on our emotional well-being. People who feel sad or discouraged tend to prefer dark tones, while those who are full of energy opt for vibrant and striking colors. But there's more to it than just mood. Your choice of clothing also affects how others perceive you it's as if your clothes were a silent language that communicates your mood to the world. Wearing colors that make you feel confident can radiate that confidence to others. In the United States, there's a famous piece of advice, dress for success. This isn't just a popular saying, 
it's backed by science. When you dress in a way that makes you feel powerful and capable, you are more likely to act that way, and others will respond to you accordingly. Think about a time when you dressed up for a special occasion. Maybe it was a job interview, a wedding, or a significant event. How did you feel in those moments? Chances are, you felt more confident and self-assured. This is the power of clothing on our mood and perception. By making mindful choices about what we wear, we can influence our emotions and the way others see us. To apply this knowledge in your daily life, start by paying attention to how different clothes make you feel. Notice the colors and styles that boost your mood and confidence. Incorporate more of these elements into your wardrobe. Before an important meeting or event, choose an outfit that makes you feel strong and empowered. Remember, your clothes are more than just fabric. They are a tool you can use to enhance your well-being and influence your interactions. Fact number five. The influence of constant thoughts. Have you ever felt that someone constantly occupies your thoughts as if your mind were a stage and that person the main star? You're not alone. This phenomenon is more common than you think and has deep roots in our psychology. Imagine your brain as a movie theater. Sometimes a movie, or in this case, a person, stays on the marquee longer than expected. This could be a sign that this person represents something important in your unconscious. It's not necessarily about obsession, but about your mind trying to tell you something. Maybe that person has qualities you secretly admire, or perhaps they represent something missing in your life. Our thoughts are a window into our subconscious mind, revealing desires, fears, and aspirations we might not be fully aware of. When someone is constantly on your mind, it could also be a sign that your brain is processing important information about that person or your relationship with them. It's as if your mind is working overtime to solve an emotional puzzle. This can be both fascinating and frustrating. On one hand, it's an opportunity for self-discovery and personal growth. On the other hand, it can be challenging to focus on other aspects of your life when your thoughts are preoccupied. To manage this, start by acknowledging these thoughts without judgment. Instead of getting frustrated, consider that your mind might be trying to communicate something important. Reflect on your feelings and goals and try to understand what these persistent thoughts might be telling you. Are they highlighting areas of your life that need attention or change? Use this awareness to guide your actions and decisions. It's also essential to find ways to direct your thoughts constructively. Engage in activities that bring you joy and fulfillment. Practice mindfulness and meditation to help quiet your mind and bring focus to the present moment. By doing this, you can better manage your thoughts and use them as a tool for personal growth rather than a source of distraction. Fact number six, predictability and self-control. Imagine you're in a meeting and you meet two people. One exudes strength and determination, while the other appears shy and reserved. Who would you consider more dangerous? Contrary to what many believe, it's often the person with the weaker character who poses more risk. This is because of predictability and self-control. A person with a strong character usually has clear goals and firm decisions. They are predictable and, in a way, more trustworthy. They know what they want and go for it directly. On the other hand, a person with a weak character can be like a box of surprises, not always pleasant ones. Their volatility and unpredictability make them less reliable and more dangerous. In life, Predictability and self-control are essential for building trust and reliability. When you can control your impulses and act consistently, people are more likely to trust you. This trust forms the foundation of strong relationships, whether personal or professional. The Stoics believed in cultivating self-control as a virtue, understanding that true strength lies in the ability to master oneself. To improve predictability and self-control, 
Start by setting clear goals for yourself. Know what you want and make firm decisions. Practice self-discipline in small daily tasks to build your ability to control impulses. By doing so, you become more reliable and trustworthy, enhancing your relationships and overall quality of life. Fact number seven, the power of words. Words have incredible power. They can inspire, heal and transform, but they can also hurt, deceive and destroy. The way we use words says a lot about our personality and reliability. People who speak little but precisely tend to be the most trustworthy. They value the power of words and understand the weight of secrets. Think about someone you know who always chooses their words carefully. They speak with intention and precision, and you likely trust them more because of it. On the other hand, those who can't stop talking, sharing every detail and others' secrets, often compromise trust without realizing it. Words can also be influenced by our hormones. For example, low testosterone levels in men can affect their mood and way of communicating. Testosterone, a hormone associated with muscles and virility, plays a crucial role in emotional well-being. When levels drop, the risk of depression increases. But don't worry, there are natural ways to combat this. Engaging in strength exercises like lifting weights, doing push-ups or squats can stimulate the production of testosterone and growth hormone. This not only strengthens your muscles but also improves your emotional well-being. Both men and women can benefit from these exercises. When you feel good about yourself, it shows in your words and how you relate to others. Next time you're in a conversation, pay attention to your words. Are you someone who speaks little but precisely, or do you share every detail? If you feel you need a boost in your well-being, move that body. Exercise not only enhances your physical condition, but also positively influences your communication and relationships. Fact number eight, fiction versus reality in media consumption. Imagine this, you're watching a horror movie. Your heart races and you feel a cold sweat down your back. Although you know it's just a movie, your body reacts as if you were in real danger. Why does this happen? Our brain processes information in fascinating ways, often blurring the lines between fiction and reality. When we watch a movie, series or play a video game, our brain doesn't fully distinguish between fiction and reality. It experiences the character's emotions as if they were our own. This explains why you feel so emotionally involved with reality show characters or why dramas can leave you with a lump in your throat. Your brain is literally empathizing and experiencing those emotions as if they were real. This phenomenon has profound implications for our daily lives. The emotions we experience, whether real or fictional, directly influence our emotional state and personal vibration. If you consume content that generates negative emotions like hate, anger, fear or frustration, you align your vibration with those negative experiences. This can attract more of the same into your life, creating a cycle of stress and negativity. On the other hand, choosing content that inspires, makes you laugh, or fills you with hope, nourishes your mind with positive emotions. It's like planting seeds of positivity in your mental garden. To maintain an emotionally healthy and positive life, it's essential to find a balance. Limit your exposure to content that drains you emotionally and focus on experiences that lift you and make you feel good. Next time you sit in front of the screen, think of it as an opportunity to nourish your mind. Choose wisely what you consume and take care of your emotional well-being. Your brain is absorbing all of this as if it were real, so don't you think it deserves the best? Fact number nine, the connection between humans and pets. Have you ever noticed how your dog seems to understand your emotions better than some people? It's no coincidence. 
the connection between a person and their pet can be as intense as the one that exists between parents and children. Incredible, right? Well, science backs it up. Recent studies have shown that losing a pet can cause pain as intense, or even more so, than losing a family member. When we interact with our pets, our bodies release oxytocin, the same hormone that activates when we hug a loved one. This chemical bond is so powerful that it transcends language and species barriers. It's why a wagging tail or a soft purr can instantly lift our spirits and provide comfort in times of distress. Pets offer unconditional love and acceptance. They don't judge or criticize. They simply exist to be with us. This pure, uncomplicated bond can be incredibly healing. In a world full of complexities and challenges, our pets provide a sanctuary of simplicity and joy. Understanding this connection can enhance our appreciation of our pets and the role they play in our lives. They teach us about unconditional love, loyalty and the simple joys of life. The next time you cuddle your pet, remember that this bond is not just emotional but also deeply physiological. Your pet is helping to keep your heart and mind healthy. In return, we can strive to be better companions to our pets. Ensure they feel loved, safe and cared for. This mutual relationship of giving and receiving love is one of the most rewarding aspects of life. So, cherish your pets and the unique bond you share with them. It's one of the purest forms of connection you'll ever experience. Fact number 10. The Law of Attraction. Have you ever felt that your thoughts have the power to shape your reality? Imagine for a moment that your mind is like a giant magnet, attracting experiences that align with your thoughts. This is the essence of the law of attraction. Think of the last time you had a really bad day. Did you notice how one negative thing seemed to lead to another until your entire day turned into a disaster? That's the law of attraction in action, but in reverse. The good news is that it also works in a positive direction. By changing your focus and being aware of what you allow into your mind, you can influence your reality. Your brain doesn't distinguish between fantasy and reality, which is why it's crucial to be selective with the content you consume. Think of it as a diet for your mind. Just as you care about what you eat to keep your body healthy, you should care about what feeds your mind. For a week, pay attention to your thoughts and the content you consume. Do they make you feel good or drag you into negative emotional states? Write it down in a journal and see how it affects your mood and daily experiences. By focusing on positive thoughts and visualizing your goals, you can attract more of what you desire into your life. A while ago, I set out to improve the content I created. I started constantly thinking about how I could do better and suddenly ideas began to flow. I wrote them down on a whiteboard at home and every day seeing it motivated me to work towards that goal. The result? Not only did I improve my content, but I also started attracting more opportunities and connections related to my goal. It's as if the universe responded to my focus and dedication. However, it's not all about action and constant movement. Excessive stress can literally shut down your brain, affecting your ability to solve problems and make decisions. That's why it's crucial to find moments of calm in your daily routine. Include meditation, reading, or simply reflecting in your daily activities. These pauses will help keep your mind clear and efficient, allowing you to attract more positive experiences. Your thoughts are powerful, use them wisely. Focus on what you want to achieve, visualize it, write it down, and work constantly towards it. But don't forget to give your mind the breaks it needs. The law of attraction is not magic, it's the result of a focused and disciplined mind. Fact number 11, inherited phobias. Imagine being afraid of something and not knowing why. It might be a fear of heights, spiders, or even public speaking. 
Now, consider the possibility that this fear isn't entirely yours. It could be an unwanted gift from your ancestors. Studies in behavioral epigenetics have shown that certain phobias can be inherited through DNA, passing down to as many as four generations. This means that your fear of heights might be linked to a traumatic experience your great-grandfather had. This fascinating discovery sheds light on the deep-rooted nature of some of our fears and how they can transcend generations. It's a reminder of how interconnected we are with our past and the experiences of those who came before us. However, the good news is that even though our fears can have deep roots, we have the capacity to face and overcome them. Understanding that a phobia might be inherited can empower you to confront it with more compassion and patience. It's not just about facing the fear, but understanding its origins and working through it methodically. One effective approach to overcoming inherited phobias is through exposure therapy, a technique where you gradually and repeatedly expose yourself to the source of your fear in a controlled and safe manner. This helps desensitize you to the fear and reduces its power over time. Mindfulness and cognitive behavioral techniques can also play a significant role in managing and diminishing phobias. So, the next time you find yourself grappling with an unexplained fear, remember that it might have deeper roots than you think. Embrace the journey of understanding and overcoming it, knowing that you are not just changing your life, but potentially breaking a cycle that has spanned generations. Fact number 12. The placebo effect. Imagine I give you a magic pill and tell you it will cure all your pains. Surprisingly, it works. But here's the plot twist. It was just a peppermint candy. Welcome to the placebo effect, a powerful phenomenon that has left doctors and scientists amazed for years. It's as if our brain is a magician, capable of deceiving itself into healing. The placebo effect demonstrates how our beliefs and expectations can significantly influence our physical health. When we believe that something will cure us, our brain releases chemicals that can relieve pain or improve our mood. This internal pharmacy is activated by positive thinking and trust in the treatment. What's even more fascinating is that the placebo effect works even when we know it's a placebo. A Harvard University study showed that patients with irritable bowel syndrome improved significantly even when they were aware they were taking placebos. It's as if our brain decides to believe in the healing power despite knowing the truth. However, there's a darker side to this phenomenon called the nocebo effect. It's like the dark side of the force in psychology. If you believe something will harm you, you might experience negative effects, even if it's completely harmless. Our negative thoughts have the power to sabotage our well-being, just as positive thoughts can heal. The placebo effect teaches us that our mind is a double-edged sword. It can be our best ally or our worst enemy. The next time you face a challenge, Remember that your brain has the power to influence your reality. Instead of running to the pharmacy for a headache, try drinking a glass of water, convinced it's the miracle cure. You might discover hidden healing powers within yourself, or at the very least, end up better hydrated. Fact number 13. Growth versus fixed mindset. Imagine two gardens. In one, the plants grow strong and vigorous, adapting to any climate. In the other, the plants remain the same, no matter how much you water them. Which would you prefer to be? The good news is that you can choose. Psychologist Carol Dweck of Stanford University discovered that people generally fall into two groups, those with a fixed mindset and those with a growth mindset. People with a fixed mindset believe their abilities are innate and cannot change. If they fail, they think, I'm not good at this. On the other hand, people with a growth mindset see opportunities to learn and improve. Their motto is, I'm not good at this yet, but I can get better. This distinction is crucial for personal development. 
a fixed mindset limits potential, while a growth mindset opens up endless possibilities. Many successful people, including famous athletes and authors, have adopted a growth mindset. Michael Jordan, one of the greatest basketball players of all time, was cut from his high school team. Instead of giving up, he used that rejection as motivation to improve. Similarly, J.K. Rowling, the author of Harry Potter, faced numerous rejections before her manuscript was accepted. She saw each rejection as an opportunity to perfect her work. Your brain is plastic, meaning it can change and grow throughout your life. Every time you learn something new, you're literally creating new connections in your brain. So, the next time you face a challenge, remember that you're not stuck in a fixed mindset. Cultivate that internal confidence and see how your world changes. True control lies in how you react to situations, not in the situations themselves. Bonus fact, NASA scientist's genius wave audio. Imagine being able to unlock your brain's full potential with just a few minutes of audio. NASA scientists have created a groundbreaking seven minute audio called the genius wave, designed to tap into your brain's hidden capabilities. Picture yourself effortlessly attracting success and happiness. It sounds like science fiction, but it's rooted in the latest advancements in neuroscience. The Genius Wave is a product of extensive research into brainwave frequencies and their impact on cognitive function. By listening to this audio, you can align your brainwaves to a state of optimal performance, enhancing your creativity, focus, and problem-solving abilities. This isn't about magic or shortcuts. It's about harnessing the power of your mind through scientifically proven techniques. To use the Genius Wave, find a quiet place where you won't be disturbed. Close your eyes, put on your headphones, and press play. As you listen, allow yourself to relax and follow the guided instructions. The audio is designed to gradually shift your brain into a state of heightened awareness and clarity. With regular use, you might notice significant improvements in your ability to concentrate, generate ideas, and achieve your goals. Incorporating the genius wave into your daily routine can be a game changer. Whether you're preparing for an important presentation, working on a creative project, or simply seeking to enhance your overall well-being, this tool can help you unlock new levels of potential. It's like having a personal brain coach guiding you towards success. So if you're ready to transform your life and tap into your brain's full potential, give the Genius Wave a try. It's an extraordinary opportunity to elevate your mental game and achieve the success and happiness you've always dreamed of. Understanding these psychological insights isn't just about satisfying curiosity. It's about making practical changes that can significantly improve your life. By applying these principles, you can boost your self-confidence, enhance your relationships, and navigate life with a greater sense of control and purpose. Whether it's leveraging the hidden power of a smile, embracing a growth mindset, or understanding the deep connections we share with our pets, these psychological facts provide the tools you need to foster a more fulfilling and balanced existence. Drop a 100 if you've watched this far. This shows that you're part of the 0.01% who actually finish what they start. Your dedication and willingness to learn are key to making real, lasting changes in your life. If you're serious about transforming your life, Make sure to join our community by subscribing to our channel. Stay connected for more insightful content that will guide and support you on your journey to self-improvement.